Hey, what's going on guys? It's Lachlan here and welcome back to a brand new video on the Lachlan Plays channel, episode 2 of my Pokemon Omega Ruby series and technically the first upload on this channel. What you guys can expect on this channel is a bunch of gaming videos other than Minecraft, mainly going to focus on Nintendo games as they are my favorites, but of course you may see the odd just random uh, like video game that you've never seen before and stuff like that. So hopefully going to have a lot of fun on this channel and you guys hopefully will as well. But episode 2 of the series, if you did miss episode 1, it is on my main channel where I did post episode 1 of the series and where I post my Minecraft content as well. And uh, yeah, if you want to check that out, episode 1. But before we get right into this episode, I would also like to thank Josh or Inkbite who did us an amazing overlay and uh, thumbnail for the series. Much better than the one I had for my last season. Now, is he still blocking the way? No, he's not. And what was the excuse? I thought I was sketching some rare Pokemon prints. I turned out they were my own footprints. Yeah, that's right. It's just like, come on, dude. Uh, let's just check these houses before we get right into it. But yeah, like I was saying, oh, wow, I just realized like I can look at the screen because I have OBS um, that I'm using to record it. So I don't need to look right down on my computer. I can just look at this. It's so much better. Wow, it's like a widescreen DS. I'm just looking at my computer to play. This is awesome. Um, anyway, but um, like I was saying, big thanks to Eggbite. And of course, um, I'm going to change the episode title in the overlay to just like simply what I like, just comment questions of the day, I guess you could say. So the first one for today is what is your favorite Pokemon? So leave in the comments what your favorite Pokemon is out of all the six, is it six or seven generations. I don't even know these days. I think it's six. Um, and uh, yeah, let's see if we can like, you know, if you see someone that has the same one as you, favor it up. And let's see what like the most common favorite Pokemon is um, between you guys. I doubt, I don't know. I feel like the most one we'll get is like 10 or 20. I don't know, but it might make for some like cool stuff. I don't know. We'll see. But that's that, and uh, let's continue our adventure. So moving on, I think this is... Oh, this is a route. Okay, now I believe Taylor is on this. Let's use our thing to search, because I think I see a... Um, there's a Wingull. Ne nearby Pokemon is a Wingull. Okay, this thing is really weird. I'm still learning how this Navdex works. Um, okay, let's see here. You're going to fight me, so let's just go. Wow, it even has that same theme. That's crazy. All right, I'm going to turn down a little bit, just in case it gets um, claimed. Okay. Youngster Calvin sent out Zigzagoon. Alrighty, buddy. Mudkip, let's go. We still have that Poochiana with Firefang. I'm probably not going to include him in my team just because, uh, I don't know, I'm just not feeling a Mudkip. Uh, not a Mudkip, of course I'm feeling the Mudkip. Not feeling a, uh, and I was never a fan of Mightyana. Just never was a fan. Zigzagoon, I love how he like attacks with a zigzag. It's so cute. Because you never get to see that in the old versions. It was just like a flat image. Um, cool flat images. In Emerald, they sort of moved for a second and twitched a little bit. But in this one, yeah. I don't know. I can't believe I ever used to just look at straight images. Now it's all 3D and animated. It's like as if I'm playing, like, Pokemon Stadium. But, like, oh, I scared him away. I think it was just a wingo, though. So it's, like, literally, like, whatever. Um, there's a Poochiana. Wait, what? Oh, I, I think I can use it to search for a... It seems to be Pokemon somewhere. All right. Where is it? I just want to use this for a little bit. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, oh. All right, let's have a look. All right, let's have a look. All right, it is. Poochiana with the first move, tackle, ability, run away. Well, you're going to run away. Because <laughs> I didn't want to burst him. Um, you were spotted. Right, I don't even want to mess around with all that. Um, let's just try and get some XP. Okay, let's see what that is. Let's see what... The I'm just like, oh, I don't want to mess about that. Oh, it's Sursky. I remember this guy. All right, let's uh, take him down. Oh, no, actually, he's not that good for XP. Um, all right, let's go for this trainer. You know, we'll make some progress in this series. Okay, here we go. I just realized I could have easily done a webcam. Well, apart from the way it would fit on the screen, it would be cramped. But now that I'm looking at the screen, it would have worked just fine. But that's all good. Um, like I said, I do want to have a lot of face cam on this channel. Um, but obviously it doesn't work so much for the, uh, this series, just for the layout and all. Alright, this guy, they don't give any XP, so it's like no in, like incentive to taking these guys down. It's like, come on. Oh, that, that classic theme. I love that classic Hoenn, like, trainer theme. It's so good. Alright, he is down and out. And level 9 Mudkip is out and about. Awesome, awesome. Mudkip learned Mud Slap. Alright, moving on. You have been executed. Alright. Alright, go through here. I don't know. Oh, the berries. I remember these guys. The berries. Okay, let's go with the berries. 
<laughs> I want to hit the berries up. And you have to, like, replant them. Oh, they were so cool. I remember there was, like, this Mirage Island that had these really rare berries. But I can never find it. You had to go to, like, I think it's Padalog City? I don't know. It's something with all the, like, all the logs. The floating log city, I like to call it. Um, oh, we let Mud Slap. That's not good on Dark, I don't think. So there's no point. Plus, it does no damage. Um, yeah, it has this place. But, it, no, it's like... I think it, I want to say Padalog City. I want to say that, but there's this guy you go to, and you have to have, like, a Pokemon that, um, he has a number, and you have to go in with that Pokemon, it's, like, random chance, and then he'll say, yeah, it's there, and, uh, I always try to get it, it was, like, the only thing I didn't do in this, apart from all those events, which I couldn't do, because I was never, like, well, I mean, I didn't even think they have any Australian events, I always hated that, by the way, like, I'm glad now, these days, for people that have just started, like, playing Pokemon, these days, you can get events by just, um, like, being connected to the internet, and they give away, like, shiny Metagross and shiny Veldrum, which I think I actually have to do, um, but back in the day, they had the, especially in, like, the Silver days, still in the Ruby days, they had places where you could go get, um, now, I never saw it in full, but you could go to the moon, and every day, I would go to the space station and see, because apparently he would change his numbers every day, and... I'd pray for the day where I'd say, do you want to go to space? Because I always read on the internet that you could go to the space and get... Uh, I'm going to plant some berries here. Uh, we'll just plant two patches. Two patches. Um, but, um, yeah, no, I'd, I'd go there every day and I'd, just be, I'd be waiting for, like, the, the text to say something different and say, do you want to go to the moon or something? Because, yeah, like I said, I always read on the internet that you could go to the moon and get Deoxys. Um, this might have a secret Pokeball. Or it might put me backwards. And it did just that. Alright, let's see what that Pokemon is. Alright, let's see what that is. Okay, let's slow it down. What do we got? Because if it's a Taylor, I'd love a cool Taylor. Hmm, like I don't really care about those Xigoons, so whatever. Um, like, I, yeah, there's some Pokemon I just don't care about. Um, you were spotted. I really don't care. Alright, we're making literally no progress here, so let's just get out of here. I would like to catch that Taylor, though. That's the only reason I'm trying. Bruh. Alright, let's go. I'm going to keep winning and be the best trainer ever? Sure, mate. Same. All right. What's he got going? Dun, dun, dun. Tiana. I think I can. <laughs> easy, easy. We probably even get a marsh top this, um, this episode, to be honest. All right. Mudkip, you're out. Okie dokie. And we'll go for a water gun. Let's do it, buddy. Pew. And I hope you guys are enjoying the 720p 60fps episodes. Um, I think 60fps... It's just so much easier with OBS because I don't even render these. I've got the whole layout set up. And I might even do some streams later on. Guys, let me know if you want some uh, Pokemon Omega Ruby streams. I might be able to cut, set a couple up because I've got literally the whole setup here. It's, this is an edit. Like, the first episode was edited in. Um, this is all just straight in uh, OBS. This whole layout, everything. So I could, you know, mix around and maybe do some streams with this. Like, Wi-Fi battles with you guys and stuff. But obviously, I want to do that, like, at, after the series, I think. All right. Found a potion. Awesome. Free potions, that's great. Alright. Um, apparently there's something called Pokemon Bank where you can get... Oh, there's May again. Hello. Hey. How's it going? Have you been using your Dex Nav? It reacts to Pokemon Era, so it's really handy. Sick. Um, ah. Look up there. Check them out. Is it Latios and Latias? Oh, no, it's Beautiflies. Oh, okay. Okay. Sick. Why don't they have the moth ones? The moth ones are cute too. <laughs> those are beautiful, weren't they? Oh, no, those are beautiful, weren't they? Sorry. Um, but wow, we've already made it through Route 102. How come I couldn't find any in the bushes? Yeah, Pedalberg City. This is one where my dad is the trainer. Uh, gym leader, sorry. Now, I remember if I... Like, this is how good my memory is. I am, like, 200% sure that you can catch routes in this little patch of grass here. You can catch a route. But... That's a route. Let's see if he's any good. Because I'd be down for a Gardevoir. I would be down for a Gardevoir. Let's have a look. What? That's a Beautifly? Okay. Let's go. Looks like a route. But it says Beautifly. Okay. Well, this thing just lied to me. It said Beautifly. Maybe it was talking about the Beautifly that ran past. Alright, this one is definitely a route. Oh, level 13. He would be an awesome pickup if we can get him. Um, oh, that's just... Uh, he's like the Abra of the third gen, dude. That is such lame. That's so lame. That is so lame. Okay, I'm not even going to rate that. You have st There are still Pokemon in this area that you have not caught. 
Well, duh. It's only got like... What is that? I think it's a C dot. I want to say it's a C dot. Let me have a look. It's a C dot. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with a C dot. Um, anyway, let's stop messing around with this. Let's go. All right, Petalberg. See, that route's been an amazing pickup, but it's just not going to happen. So let's go through the houses. Anything special for me? Battle of Normand once, and he wrecked you? Oh, well, that's what you get for being bad, I guess. Um, a city's new gym leader is someone. Awesome. Sick. That's my dad, mate. All right, I'm probably going to go straight to the gym. I know there's some house that gives something. I think it's this guy. Wow, look at the reflection. That's so cool. Actually, yeah, if I remember, it had the same thing, but it was... Um, they had reflection in the water in the other games as well, but it was obviously a lot worse. Wow, I remember that now. I had the puddle and everything. Um, okay, there we go. There's my dad. Hey, daddy. Not bad. It was a good battle. Come back and challenge me again soon. Yes, thank you, sir. All right. Hello, sir. Hmm? Why, if it isn't Lachlan, so finish with the end. I see. I guess we shouldn't stand around here talking. Do you want to come in for a bit? We can talk in the gym. It's pronounced gym, right? I'm joking. It's obviously the gym. All right, let's see. Uh, something to look forward to. Excuse me. I'd like to get a Pokemon, please. Oh, I remember this. That's right. Wally. I'm supposed to go away with my relatives in Veneta for a while. This isn't the same Wally verse at the end, is it? Is it? Zigzagoon. It is Wally that you verse at the end, isn't it? But he looks so much older at the end of it. He looks like a little boy there. Because I remember, you gotta like try and catch a Ralts for a kid. That's why I remember those Ralts there, because you catch something with the guy. Surely that can't be the same guy. Please stand there to watch so if I can see if you catch one properly. <laughs> I remember this. I think he catches it. Ralts, and yeah, it becomes like a big part of his team. Alright. Surely it can't be the same one. Let me Google this right now. No, I can't because otherwise it'll mess up the bottom screen. Alright. Let's see. He's using tackle. Fair enough. Uh, oh, that's a nice tackle. It's going to do just enough. Oh, how come his isn't teleporting away? How come... Oh, maybe level 5 routes can't teleport. I can't believe that. That would have been such a good pickup. Alright. And that should be enough for a Pokeball. Good shout. He's growling. It's not very nice. Alright, attack felt. I'm supposed to try and weak the Pokemon for a Pokeball, right? Yep, that's how you do it, Wally. <laughs> I read that in a book. Alright, there you go. Bag, Pokeballs. Watching a noob catch Pokemon. So exciting. Alright. And is he going to catch it? Should so. Pretty sure he does every time. Alright, easy game. Well done, Wally. You are now awesome. <laughs> okay. I did it. It's my Pokemon. Thanks so much, Lachlan. Let's head back to the gym. To the game. Sure. Da -da -da. All right. Let me give you back your Pokemon, sir. And you, Lachlan, thank you so much for coming with me. I didn't really do much. <laughs> I'm always, I'm always treasure. I know. I'm. Not, it's not much of a thank you, but I'm Lachlan. Will you let me see your Pokenab Plus for a second? Oh, what's he gonna give me? Pokenab Plus. Wait, you can now use the PlayNav feature on your PokeNav Plus. I read in a book how you can use the PlayNav to take care of your Pokemon and train them. And there's even supposed to be this thing called PSS where you can meet up with other trainers and battle friends. Oh, is that where I do the training thing? I don't want to do that again. I did that so much in my last series with the gym bags. I don't... There's no way it's the same thing in it. Can't be. Keep an eye on. But for now, Lachlan, if you want to become strong as a trainer, listen to my advice. Rustboro City... Yeah, that's the first gym. Collect the badges. We've done that before. All right, let's go. Collect the badges. All right. What's this guy doing? Look a little suspicious, mate. Let's see you have six Pokemon. You catch someone. Yeah, it goes to the box, mate. Ugh, these guys are trying to teach me how to Pokemon, man. It's a little embarrassing. All right. Let's see what's in here. Oh, this is like the Wally's house. Wait, and if you go around here? No. Just checking everything. I remember there's, a, there's that place just up above Petalburg that does berries and stuff. Um, and there's the Petalburg Forest as well. Oh, it might be the same, Wally. Alright, moving on. Let's, uh, I think we'll clear that. We've pretty much cleared this place. So yeah, now we go into the Petalburg Forest. There's a little bit, then we go into the forest. And then there's that guy with the boat. 
Oh, the dude with the boat, man. He was the best. Dude, oh, that's so cool. There's like wild wing gulls, like seagulls. That's sick. All right, let's go. And I remember that guy, if I'm correct, that guy running around. Oh, what? No, this guy has a tailor, if I'm correct. Like, I just remember him running around and always having a tailor. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Like, this is my memory, dudes. No, oh, this is a dot first. I know someone in this area has a tailor. I just know. Damn, that's not a good matchup. Alright. We'll go for the tackle squad. Bye, it's cheeky. It's very cheeky indeed. Tackle, let's go. Oh, please don't unleash it on me. He has to wait one more turn. Yeah, I think he releases it next turn. Bye was such a useless move. I never liked it. Alright, GG, C dot. A uh, bye. Alright, what's up next? A Taylor, that's what I said, guys. I think there's a guy with a really high level Taylor, though. Alright, I can't wait to get my own Taylor. He's so cool. Alright. I remember when I was such a noob, I think the first, like, ever time I played this game, um, I went for a. I think it was a. Yeah, it was a Trico. And, um, what happened was. I got up to a bit where you had to like try and teach your Pokemon surf and I had no Pokemon in the area that I thought would no surf and my starter Pokemon didn't have surf so I restarted my whole game to pick up Mudkip and then I found out you can teach Zigzagoon and I was like what the hell why the hell can Zigzagoon learn surf this isn't right um, but yeah that's how I sort of used Mudkip um, my first ever like playthrough oh it's his wing goal that's his wing goal yeah I forgot your battle Mr. Briny Oh god, man, Mr. Briny goes off. Alright, let's see. No, that's all them dumb. Alright. This guy, oh, his boat's just as cool. Alright, and wait, is this Wingo making noises? Peaky! Alright, let's have a chat to him. Ho, 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 my pretty Piku. Uh, Alright, let's. Are you battling? Okay, will you give him one of your potions? Sure, you're gonna give me anything in return? Alright, do we get anything back? Surely he's gonna give us something. We get nothing. Maybe just get good karma? Like, I don't know. Um, I want to try and get above there and... How do you get up there? I want to get those items. Oh, I think you got to go all the way around. Alright, we're making not as much progress as I wanted to this episode. I think you have to go all the way around. Or you have to come out of the forest? I don't know. Alright. I should make sure I come back and get those patches. I'm probably not going to plant these trees back because I'll really... I will forget. Um, <laughs> I will forget to put them back. And to pick them up later. So I'll just pick them up for now. Um, alright, let's get this guy. Okay, I don't want the next Pokemon. You're a trainer, I know it. I think you have, like, the, the Wormpool line or something. Uh, Rich Boy Winston? Yeah, oh, Zigzagoon, okay. Got that one wrong. Alright, Mudkip's getting pretty tanky, though, I'm not gonna lie. I maybe want to go back and try and get a Taylor out of that. Out of that. I'm thinking I might want to go back and get a Taylor. Um, I just really want to get a, th a second Pokemon because this forest is full of there's some grass types in there, and like I think we know Mudkip doesn't go up well against some grass types. So I'd like, and I don't want to use like I said I don't want to use Puchiana. He's just not my he's not my Pokemon, man. He's just not my Pokemon. Uh, Mudkip to level 11, awesome. Okay, Winston, GG, my friend. Alrighty. Let's go back and uh, I don't think there's any in this. Why has the music gone off? Is it normal every time? Oh, yes! Taylor! Awesome! Now, please don't tell me you know Whirlwind. Okay, what level are you? Five. That's a good level. I think the highest you can get in this area is six. Uh, we have her tackle. Hopefully, it does just under half. Um, and that almost killed you. Okay, that's probably good enough. All right. If it credit, I would have been so disappointed. Um, all right. Pokeball and Pokeball. Let's go. Okay, come on Taylor. Let's go buddy. He is he, he is my Pidgey of the Hoenn region and If you guys don't know Pidgeot's like my favorite Pokemon. Actually, I just, yeah, I forgot to answer the question of the day. Oh Taylor, come on um, What is your favorite Pokemon if you're asking me? It is Pidgeot. He is my favorite and there is Mega Pidgeot in this so Hopefully that can happen, but we got to find oh if we, we can't have Swallow and Pidgeot Ooh, That might uh that might upset a couple people. Um, hopefully this guy doesn't be a jag again. Thank you very much. Alright, Taylor was caught. 
Thank you, buddy. Being uh, nice and cooperative. Alrighty. Dun, 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 dun. I like the models of this, man. It looks so cool. Registration completed. Ah, no, we won't give you a nickname. Alrighty. Too easy. Now, let's organize my Pokedex. Um, okay. That is the Pokedex. Sorry, I want to manage my party. Um, this button. Okay, let's just move and switch it with this guy. Oh, I do want to pick up... Is it a zigzagoon that just randomly finds items everywhere you go? It is, isn't it? I want to try and find a zigzagoon. Let's see if a zigzagoon rolls around here. Because, yeah, Zigzagoon has this thing where he randomly finds items everywhere. I just remember that. Wingull. Ugh. I guess we might try and catch, like, as many Pokemon as we can as well. No harm in that. I mean, if it's going to let me catch him with After Tackle, then I'll go for it. But if not, then no. Alright, he's dead. Thanks for the easy XP. I do need to restore these guys up, though, as well. I feel bad. Um, possibly have 10 Pokeballs. Come on, I really want a Zigzagoon. Because then we can just get easy free items. Um, I don't... Oh, Wurmple. I don't think Ziggler even spawns in this area. I think he might spawn in the forest, though, so we'll just go in the forest. Because if I remember correctly, I think he does. Alright, that should one-bang a Wurmple anyway. Alright, too easy. Easy XP, even though he gives none. He he is the Caterpie of the Hoenn region. Um, there's so many equivalents in this one, I swear. Alright. Oh! Something just made a thing. Um, oh, same theme! It goes... Doo -doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. Oh, uh, so it's the same sort of spooky theme. I love it. All right. Actually, let's restore this guy with a potion. We have 10 of them, so... Wow, we have 10 of them. I was, like, trying to save them. All right, let's uh, put him in the front slot. Hopefully... Yeah, he has Peck, so... Should be quite useful in this place. Dude, I just love how they've used the same theme for this place. It's so scary. Do, 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 do. All right. Found a potion. If I remember, there's some guy from some corporation in here that you save from Team whatever the hell you're with. And I believe this one is Magma. So, yeah, Team Magma. Um, okay. This is the other side, so we can get that Pokeball. Found a Pokeball. Easy game. Another Pokemon to catch. Awesome, awesome. Um, no, that's it. All right, up into the forest we go again. Um, and these episodes, guys, are hopefully going to be around 25 minutes long. We've been uh, we've going through 22 minutes, so we'll finish this uh, forest, get through it all the way, and then we'll probably wrap it up. Bit of a 30-minute episode. Our last one was 30. So let's see how much we do with our, uh, our little Taylor here. Mug catch a Lyle. Wurmple. Alrighty. That's a good Pokemon, because, yeah, we, we want, like, a couple of these guys just to get some pecs off at. Alright, it's up to you, buddy. Hit them with the pecs. It's up to you. Do at least half. Yes, buddy. Tackle. That should do nothing. Yeah, awesome. Okay, hopefully get some... Oh, but they don't give... They're like... I feel like they're Magikarps because they're red. They give no XP. Just like a Caterpie, though. All right. And what's he going to give us? 60? Oh, yes. Made it. Awesome. Okay. And the good thing about Taylor is he's really good on the second gym as well. Because um, the second gym is fighting. I remember my Taylor just soloed the second gym. With his peck. Um, peck, there you go. Okay, he's not one hit status yet. String shot, that slows you down, if I believe. Yep. Just trying to re remember all the moves. Yep, harshly fell. Is it enough to beat me, though? No, because Taylor is very quick. Alright. <laughs> I love how the peck animation's on point. You just peck. Um, Alright. Taylor gained. Oh, yes, level 7. Making some movements already, buddy. I love it. Okay, and another Wurmple. It's like three Magikarps, man. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, at least I got two Pokemon now. Because, yeah, I was really scared of the forest moving in with just a Mudkip. It would have been so boring if we hit grass types and then just get wrecked. Um, Alright, and just the Peck to kill this guy off. And that is done and dusted. Thanks for the XP, my friend. Oh, yes, level 8. We got one from each of them. Awesome. Any moves? Uh, no. Damn it. Okay. Thanks for the XP, my friend. Alright. Let's see. Paralyze heal. Okie doke. Too easy. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, here it is. This is where you save the guy, if I'm correct. Yep. Now, this guy has, like, mighty adders and stuff, so I would love to switch out. 
No, the magma skin looks pretty cool. <laughs> He's not happy, boys. All right. He wants it. Hand it over, Devin. Okay. Come on. What is that battle? Oh, whatever, man. <laughs> oh, wow. I love this intro. Yeah, it's the same as the original. Yeah, see, so called it. Pucciano. All right. This will be... In the actual original one, he has, like, the Pucciano, like, boss him around, if I'm correct. All right. Okay. We're going to go for some Peck City. Uh, I don't know if it'll do... Oof, we might need a poor swap because I don't want him to die. Yeah, that's a swap. Okay. See you, boys. On my way to swap it out. Mudkip, you're up. Mudkip dies. We're screwed. He should be able to tank at least one tackle and then dish out maybe two water guns. And then if Taylor needs to, he can finish it off. I think he heals you after this battle. Though. Oh, he hits a crit. Yeah, we'll be fine. That's, that's good, though. That'll be fine. We can tank probably two of them. Oh, easy game. Easy game. And rip that Pucciana. And Taylor gets level 9. Awesome. A quick attack. Awesome. Okay. Thanks for the XP and the cash, boys. I find it weird how he's trying to rob that guy, but it will still pay out when he loses. Like, if someone beat me in any sort of physical or any other sort of confrontation, and I'm trying to steal something, I would not pay them. Like, I, I don't I don't know. I don't get that. Um, Alright. <laughs> Turn the switch on and we'll be shared by all party Pokemon. Please give it a try. And with this, it'll restore... Oh, yeah. Here we go. We'll restore your Pokemon's health. Awesome. Thank you very much. Did need that. Um, did that make... Don't say you were something. Rust Burrow. It's a crisis. Can't be waiting. Oh, and that's one Pokemon I would like to get as well is the Anorith Fossil. Um, that's the one I went for back in the old days. So, I think I might go for an Anorith Fossil. I really did like... What's his name? Armaldo. Really did like him. Okay. Not so much the Lilip and Cradilly. Uh, he was a bit weird, though. The leap was cool, I guess, to an extent. All right, here we go. Bug catcher James sent out Ninkata. Oh, that reminds me of this guy. I remember taking Shed Ninja is just the weirdest Pokemon, and I remember trying to get him so hard. And uh, I always had a because the way you get it is you get Ninkata to evolve to the whatever the hell the next one is called. I don't know what it's called, um, but you have to have a Pokeball and a spare slot in your party. And it'll create another Pokemon as well called Shed Ninja. And uh, it's supposed to be like the skin of an Incarta. And it has this ability called Wonder Guard, which makes it so that only super effective moves will hit you. So only a couple of moves can hit you. Um, keep old moves. Foresight's garbage. Alright. But um, yeah, it was uh, quite chaotic. I remember I was doing like competitive battling at school. Not competitive, but like. After school care, everyone would bring their DS's to play Pokemon, and, uh... <laughs> oh, DS's? No, sorry, Game Boy SP's. Uh, alright, we're probably gonna need... Yeah, we need to cut to do that. Oh, here's some Pokemons, what is that? It's probably a C dot. Alright, we'll leave it there. Um, but, uh, yeah, we'd, we'd go... And I remember trying to catch the Reggie's as well. Oh, Magma's not happy. This is Petal Bird, a recon team, checking in. I'm afraid I have to begin with an apology, Miss Courtney. It's not good news. Missions go. A little something cropped up in the way. Good, it will do. This... Go. Phew. Oi. It's not... It's not whole grudges now. You just got wrecked, is all. <laughs> all right, and then it comes up and there's like this little um thing over here. That, yeah, that does berries. We'll take the berries and we'll plant the berries for next episode, I guess. Um, let me take these. But guys, like I said, I'm going to wrap this episode up right here. We're out of the uh, the forest, so we'll plant some iron berries. Um, so I hope you guys did enjoy this episode of the Pokemon Omega Ruby series. Episode 2 and the first official video on the second channel. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like rating below. And of course, if you want to follow along with the series, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well. Wow, the cherry berry even uses the same icon. It looks exactly the same. Um, but uh, yeah, of course then, have a good day. And I will see you tomorrow with a brand new episode of Pokemon Omega Ruby, which is going to be up for a while, daily uploads. And uh, yeah, see you guys then.